Hey guys, I'm back in the last part of Lock Zhang Jiao's level 11 weapon, the Staff of Peace. And now, we're going to go back way down to level 11 weapon, which had a total of 2 votes. So, just like any other level 11 weapon, we have to go to Legend Mode. And since we're going for Wei Yan's, we have to go to his Legend Stage. And I'll show off the 6 Ma like always. Alright, here we go. So, we already know the narration and the special rules, so we'll move on. We know the objectives, we know the unit info, the equipment, the weapon, as you know, we have the Comet Strike at level 10. The items. The only thing I'm going to swap out is the Wind Squirrel, and I'm going to replace that with the Weyamusu. I can't have any bodyguards, so move on, and that will cover it all. So let's do it. All right. So in order to obtain the S rank here and unlock Wei Yan's level 11 weapon, just like Zhang He's, there are two different ways to get this weapon. The first way, which is the way that we're going to do it, is complete the stage very quickly before Zhuge Liang even has a chance to turn on us. Why do you so I have two and a half minutes to do that. And let's be very careful with that. Alright, Zhao Wei is down. Uh, the other way to get the level 11 weapon is if you allow Zhuge Liang to turn on you. Then, hang on a second. If you allow Zhuge Liang to turn on you, you have to defeat every Shu general and officer in the stage and get 200 KOs and then approach Zhuge Liang. Well, no particular order, but make sure you do all that. Anyways, Zhao He is down. And now we'll go for the final Zhao. And I think that's Zhao Hoi. Yep. And there's no KO requirements for this particular part here. So, anyways. Alright, that's three, and I have one more to go, and we'll get the weapon. Or, we already have it. It's just, uh, we need to defeat the final enemy general, and that's Zhao Ba. And he's pretty easy to defeat. And at this point, Zhuge Liang will help you out take over the castle. So there's no need for you to worry about Zhuge Liang turning on you at this point. And there we go. And that's a win. Alright, so that's another one down. Like I said before, there are two different ways to get the weapon, but I'll talk about it in a second. And, uh, anyways, our KO count is 10. We defeated, well, we really didn't defeat everybody in the stage, but we defeated the three Zhaho's to get the weapon, and then Zhaho Ba, well, Zhaho Wei, Zhaho He, and Zhaho Hui, and then Zhaho Ba. Our clear time is 2 minutes and 13 seconds. The points, bear with me for a bit. 6,400 and uh, that doesn't matter because the points and the rank are both at max and there's the level 11 weapon the meteor strike and just like any other level 11 weapon 
The attack power is a plus 60. And the items that come with it are the Peacock Urn, which gives you additional health. A level 18, Naimon Armor, Bow Defense, level 14. Cavalry Armor, Mounted Defense, level 16. And a Herbal Remedy, which gives you additional... Which deals additional damage anytime you use a charge attack. That's at level 19. In order to get this weapon, as I said before, there are two different ways to get it. The first way, which is the way that I did it, is defeat Jaho Hoi, Jaho Ha, and Jaho Wei within around two to two and a half minutes, basically before Juga Liang turns on you and before Simi Yi says to uh, not to attack Wei Yan, which ultimately leads to Juga Liang turn on you. So once you defeat those three and discover Jaho Ba, Juga Liang will not turn on you and he'll help you take over the castle. Now, the other way, the other way that I didn't show off, all you have to do for that is, once Zhuge Liang does turn on you, you need to defeat every enemy general and officer under the Shu forces, get 200 KOs, and approach Zhuge Liang. And uh, you'll get the weapon that way. There's no real wrong choice or right choice. That choice is up to you. But uh, if executed properly, like I just did there, it will be very, very easy to get the level 11 weapon for Wei Yan. It's just whether or not you really want to take that easy route or not. But at the end of the day, you're unlocking the weapon regardless. So, anyways. And the same rule applies to Zheng He's too. But I already got his weapon ready and all that. So, anyways. The grade... We got S, obviously, it was just a matter of how many points. We got the 100 points. We'll save, and there you have it. If you've been watching my gaming adventures, Fijian Dynasty Warriors for, in some cases, Extreme Legends. Well, in this case, it really is Extreme Legends, and kind of anticlimactic for the fact that it was actually pretty short, similar to Zhang He's. But anyways, I will see you in the next part, where we will go and unlock another level 11 weapon. And the next level 11 weapon we're going to be getting is Dong Zhuo's. So, peace out.